what's going on everybody it's robin here <laughs> welcome to your daily tarot card reading for tuesday march 21st this is the starman tarot card deck and i'm going to start shuffling it just a reminder these are readings for the collective and they are general if you would like answers to questions or have a look at peek into your future and, and you'd like a private reading just let me know uh, my email address it should be in the description box or just comment that you would like the booking info and I'll send you that okay it can be really helpful for you on your path all right so let's get into the reading no it's not a knocking door it's me so you have the two of wands so this is always like that mindset of which way do I go okay so you have this character and he's standing there and he's clearly at a crossroads like which way do I go okay so there is a big decision coming into your life here your spirit guides are always available to help you. You can see that there is the specter of David Bowie there. So, I mean, you can always count on your higher self. I do advocate highly for Steve Nobel meditations. Like, he's just really amazing. And he does have, like, meditations that are focused on connecting with your team and spirit. And if you've ever listened to his meditations... The way he calls in all these angels and ancestors and, and whoever else is available, it gives you kind of a recognition of who is there and able to help you. So don't ever feel like you're alone on your path, even if you are alone, like physically in your path, because you're not. You're not ever. Okay, so you do have the Ace of Pentacles. So it looks like what I'm seeing here is... Like the words that I got is that a wish is about to be granted for you and you must understand that no matter what path you take, it's going to be the right one for you. So whatever it is that you're holding in your heart deeply, it's never going to escape you. Hold on for a sec. Because you do have this Ace of Pentacles and this means as above, so below. So you've already done the work and we saw that in yesterday's reading, okay? So just keep on going, have some self-confidence, okay? Um, the world card is showing a lot of accomplishment coming in today. So this is kind of a really inspiring reading for you that you can't put a foot wrong on your path, even though you might trip and fall, you might stumble, it's gonna be okay, no matter what is going on in your life, okay? So, I'm seeing a lot of like the darkness coming up in reading so far this week, okay? So we do have the Five of Cups and, and this is not a really pleasant energy to be in, okay? So if you do have regrets about your life and the things that you've done and maybe the people that you've hurt and the mistakes that you've made, it's time to really move on past that because that's going to be the thing that holds you back in your life. Not anything else, not anybody else. This is you. Like it's really time to get out of your own way. The five of cups is super sad and looking into the past and it's okay to take a walk down memory lane, but it's important to remember that you don't live there. Okay. You live now, you live in the present. So you got to snap yourself out of anything that is dragging you down, particularly if it's other people that are reminding you of any faults or errors that they have perceived that you have made along your way. OK, so I really see that this is time to weigh anchor away from the past and just move forward because you have so much potential here with the Ace of Pentacles and the world card, which I can't find. Hold on. This is your manifestational power, okay? And this is you accomplishing everything. So if somebody's holding you back, including you, it might take uh, like a cord cutting ceremony or meditation or whatever. Again, I would recommend either Kenneth Suarez or Steve Noble to help you really, really get to know yourself a little bit better and to call in your team and spirit. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs> Bye.